Good afternoon, Massachusetts friends, and hello to my friend, Nina Turner. It's truly an honor to be here with my colleague and friend and Ohio native, Rep. Nika Allegardo. And it's so good to be here with my friend, Jared Hicks, and folks like Larry Cohen and Varshini and Jeanette and Nicholas and others. I apologize that I have to appear via video. At this hour, I'm with Congresswoman Ayanna Presley, and we're touring an interstate highway that cuts through the environmental justice neighborhoods of East Somerville. And we're working to demand that our state do more to mitigate the air pollution that is making our constituents sick. And really that brings me to why we're all here this evening. Because here in Massachusetts, we did our job in electing a progressive champion like Ayanna Presley. But we know that to make Medicare for all a reality, to make free college a reality, and to cancel student debt, to make the Green New Deal happen, and to pass a $15 minimum wage, we need to elect more progressive champions. We need to send reinforcements to the squad in Washington, D.C., so that we can make our agenda, which is a popular agenda that this country supports, we need to make it a reality in the United States Congress. And Nina Turner is precisely the kind of person who will pick up the charge and do that work and do it successfully. I first heard about Nina back in 2016 when she took the courageous step of backing Senator Bernie Sanders for president. And at that time, there was tremendous pressure on her to simply go with the flow and support the political establishment. But Nina stuck true to her core values, and she took a stand back at a time when no one knew where the Bernie campaign would go or how strong our movement could truly be. The Bernie campaign changed my life. It inspired me to run for state representative and working closely with folks like Jared Hicks and, and many people on this call this evening, we took on a moderate Democrat and entrenched incumbent who had won 38 elections in a row. And with the support of groups like Our Revolution and others, we won our Democratic primary. In 2017, I got to meet Nina for the first time. It was at an Our Revolution event in Washington, D.C., and it was so inspiring and exciting to see how Nina was doing the work of continuing the momentum of the Bernie campaign to make a difference all over the country. And that difference has been felt right here in Cambridge and Somerville, where our revolution and leftist candidates have transformed the local political landscape and have gone on to help elect people like Rep. Allegardo. But it wasn't until late 2019 uh, when Nina came to Cambridge to once again support Senator Sanders. And it was on that evening when she told her personal story. She told the story of the untimely loss of her mother and how that made her committed to winning Medicare for All. And it was in that moment that I was so convinced that Nina isn't a politician. She's truly on a mission to win Medicare for all, to transform our society, and to enact the policies that will give everyone the opportunity to live to their fullest potential. The truth is, working together, all of us in this room, we are changing the game. Ten years ago, Nina Turner for Congress, it, that would have been a long shot. But today, we're on the cusp of a big opportunity to send further reinforcements to support the squad in Washington, D.C., and to set the tone for the midterm elections, making it clear that our movement is ascendant and it won't be denied. I am so, so grateful that Nina has taken on this fight, and I'm grateful that all of you are here with us this evening to help provide her with the resources she needs to win. Please, donate until it hurts. Give and then give again, and text and email your friends and let them know about this race. As the headline for the event says, everything we love is on the line, and I trust that Nina will go to Congress and have a big, big impact. 
She's a game changer. And that's the impact she's brought to the Bernie campaign. And that's the impact that she will bring to Washington, D.C. Thank you, Nina, for truly being an inspiration. And I'll see you all on the phones this summer, making phone calls to elect Nina Turner.